The Legacy of Cristiano Ronaldo, A Journey of Excellence Cristiano Ronaldo, born February 5, 1985, Funchal, Madeira, Port, Portuguese football, soccer, player. While playing with Manchester United, 2003-09, he developed into one of the game's best forwards, noted for his free-reigned attacking style. In 2008, he helped United win a Champions League title, and that year he also was named FIFA World Player of the Year. In 2009, he joined Real Madrid. He won a second World Player of the Year award, renamed the FIFA Ballon d'Or, after scoring 66 goals in 2013. Early Life and Career Ronaldo's father, José Dinis Ibero, was the equipment manager for the local club Andorinha. The name Ronaldo was added to Cristiano's name in honor of his father's favorite movie actor, Ronald Reagan, who was U.S. president at the time of Cristiano's birth. At age 15 Ronaldo was diagnosed with a heart condition that necessitated surgery, but he was sidelined only briefly and made a full recovery. He first played for Clube Desportivo Nacional of Madeira and then transferred to Sporting Clube de Portugal, known as Sporting Lisbon, where he played for that club's various youth teams before making his debut on Sporting's first team in 2002. A tall player at 6 feet 1 inch, 1.85 meters, Ronaldo was a formidable athlete on the pitch. Originally a right winger, he developed into a forward with a free-reigned attacking style. He was able to mesmerize opponents with a sleight of foot that made sufficient space for openings in opposing defenses. Club Play After a successful season with sporting that brought the young player to the attention of Europe's biggest football clubs, Ronaldo signed with English powerhouse Manchester United in 2003. He was an instant sensation and soon came to be regarded as one of the best forwards in the game. His finest season with United came in 2007, 08, when he scored 42 league and cup goals and earned the Golden Shoe Award as Europe's leading scorer, with 31 league goals. After helping United to a Champions League title in May 2008, Ronaldo captured Federation Internationale de Football Association, FIFA, World Player of the Year honors for his stellar 2007-08 season. He also led United to an appearance in the 2009 Champions League final, which they lost to FC Barcelona. Soon thereafter, Ronaldo was sold to Spain's Real Madrid, a club with which he had long been rumored to want to play, for a then-record £80 million, about $131 million, transfer fee. His scoring prowess continued with his new team, and he netted the most goals, 40, in La Liga history during the 2010-11 season. His record was broken the following season by his rival Lionel Messi of Barcelona. In 2011-12 Ronaldo helped Madrid capture a La Liga championship and scored a personal best 46 goals during the league season. He scored a total of 66 goals and 56 appearances with Madrid and the Portuguese national team in 2013 to earn his second World Player of the Year award. The FIFA World Player of the Year was renamed the FIFA Ballon d'Or in 2010. In 2014, he scored 52 goals in 43 games and led Madrid to a Champions League title, which resulted in Ronaldo capturing another Ballon d'Or award. In 2014-15, he netted 48 goals to lead La Liga in scoring. Ronaldo netted his 324th goal as a member of Real in October 2015 to become the club's all-time leading goal scorer. He scored 35 La Liga goals in 2015-16 and helped Real win its record 11th Champions League title, and in December 2016, he won a fourth career Ballon d'Or for his accomplishments. Ronaldo scored 42 goals for Real across all competitions in 2016-17 and led his team to La Liga and Champions League titles that season, which resulted in a fifth career Ballon d'Or award. In 2017-18, he scored 44 goals in 44 games, and Real won a third straight Champions League title. Career At the age of 17, Ronaldo played his first professional game for the Portuguese Super League. In 2003, for the first time, Manchester United paid such a young player £12 million as a signing amount. After this, there has been no looking back. Arnold Schwarzenegger has labeled Ronaldo as the fittest athlete in the world. His body fat ratio is just 10%. Ronaldo has an amazing ability to jump really high. 
This gives him an advantage to make goals as he can jump head and shoulders higher than other footballers. He can produce five times more G-force than a cheetah during a takeoff on his jump. His free kick speed is 13.1 km per hour, equivalent to a space shuttle. Recognition on June 2010, Ronaldo became the fourth footballer ever to have a wax statue at the Madame Tussauds Museum in London. In his hometown, there is a museum, Musu CR7, which is dedicated only to Ronaldo containing his trophies, medals, rare pictures, and everything related to Ronaldo. Ronaldo was doubtful about wearing the number 7 shirt because he thought it would be too much pressure on him as the number 7 shirt was worn by legends like Johnny Berry, Eric Cantona, and David Beckham. After wearing it, he was forced to live up to the number. Ronaldo donates blood regularly and does not smoke or have any tattoos on his body. Ronaldo has won the FIFA World Player of the Year award, Ballon d'Or, the Golden Boot, and has been named the UEFA Club Forward of the Year as well. Ronaldo also has a fashion boutique named CR7 and Models for men's fashion wear. The store is famous for featuring diamond-studded clothing. He is rich and famous, but is always involved with charity, fundraising, and donations to NGOs. He has funded schools in Gaza and also acts as the ambassador to save the children and the mangrove care forum in Indonesia. Cristiano Ronaldo grew up in a small tin-roofed home in Madeira, Portugal. Ronaldo's house was level with the ground. Many are convinced that this was his wish, because he did not want the public to find out in what kind of misery he lived. He developed passion for football at a very young age. He loved the game so much that he would miss meals or escape out of his window with the ball. At 12, Ronaldo had to say goodbye to his family to play for Sporting Youth Club located 600 miles from his home. It was the most difficult time in his sporting career. He cried every day, because he missed his family. Everyone laughed at him due to his poor accent. He found it impossible to get used to the locals and big city life. His quote, In difficult times, you learn a lot about yourself. You have to stay strong and focus on what you really want. At 15, he was diagnosed with racing heart, a condition that might have forced him to give up football. But that did not stop him. Soon after the laser surgery, he was back at training again and he trained even harder. His dazzling footwork and goal-scoring abilities caught the eye of Manchester United, who signed him for $20 million. It was in a friendly game between Sporting and Man UTD, 3 o'clock. All players went to coach Alex Ferguson and told him that they must sign this youngster. No matter which team he was on, he conquered the playing field with his top-notch performance. He won everything with Manchester United and Real Madrid. He won European Championship with National Team of Portugal. He does not drink because his father was an alcoholic. He does not smoke, he does not have a tattoo, and he donates a lot of money to charities. Today, Cristiano Ronaldo is one of the best football players of all time. Respect the affirmation of the legend. Unsurprisingly, in 2009, a proposal emerged that would revolutionize CR7's career. At the age of 24, he moved from Manchester to Madrid, with Real paying 94 million euros, starring in the most expensive transfer and contract in world football so far. The man who popularizes records broke another one the day he set foot on the pitch for the first time at the Santiago Bernabeu, as a Real Madrid player. Never had so many fans watched a footballer perform live. For the eternal memory of Madridistas, there was an effusive Hall of Madrid. As in Manchester, he soon established himself in Madrid as the central figure of a club marked by an internal success shared with rivals Barcelona, but in a climate of almost despair in the search for the long-awaited 10th Champions League, which had eluded him since 2002. The CR7 factor was crucial in the collective evolution of a Real Madrid that rediscovered the glory of other times. After winning the championship, Copa del Rey and Spanish Super Cup, La Decima arrived in 2014, under the baton of a Cristiano Ronaldo from another planet, with more than 50 goals per season between 2010 and 2016. He claimed the status of legend and raised Real to the highest level in world football. Golden years in Madrid, where, in addition to becoming Real's all-time top scorer, 
With 450 goals in 438 games, he won four Champions Leagues, three Club World Cups, two European Super Cups, two Championships, two Copa del Reyes and two Super Cups. From Spain A triumphal era for the club and the national team, where he is a record holder for goals and caps, with the unprecedented achievements of Euro 2016 and the debut League of Nations, whose final phase took place in Portugal in 2019. At the individual level, the awards and distinctions followed one another at an overwhelming pace, with the heyday in 2017, the year in which he received the fifth Ballon d'Or in his career. A dream marriage that made the separation that took place in 2018 even more unpredictable, after nine unparalleled seasons in the history of Real Madrid and Ronaldo. The Affirmation of the Legend Unsurprisingly, in 2009, a proposal emerged that would revolutionize CR7's career. At the age of 24, he moved from Manchester to Madrid, with Real paying 94 million euros, starring in the most expensive transfer and contract in world football so far. The man who popularizes records broke another one the day he set foot on the pitch for the first time at the Santiago Bernabeu, as a Real Madrid player, never had so many fans watched a footballer perform live. For the eternal memory of Madridistas, there was an effusive Hala Madrid. As in Manchester, he soon established himself in Madrid as the central figure of a club marked by an internal success shared with rivals Barcelona, but in a climate of almost despair in the search for the long-awaited 10th Champions League, which had eluded him since 2002. The CR7 factor was crucial in the collective evolution of a Real Madrid that rediscovered the glory of other times. After winning the championship, Copa del Rey and Spanish Super Cup, La Decima arrived in 2014, under the baton of a Cristiano Ronaldo from another planet, with more than 50 goals per season between 2010 and 2016, he claimed the status of legend and raised Real to the highest level in world football. The good son returns home. The exit was, this time, an inevitable scenario, materialized in August of this year. Like a fairy tale, Ronaldo returned to the home that saw him emerge and assert himself on the international stage, Manchester United. A return described by himself as a dream come true. At 36, he proved once again that age is just a number and quickly satisfied the expectations of the thousands of fans who, 19 years earlier, saw an impish and irreverent young man step on the old Trafford lawn, which the years have turned into a universal reference. With an unmeasured ambition and an incomparable winning spirit, Cristiano Ronaldo continues to prove, to himself and to others, that, at 37 years old, it is by his own merit that the world sees him as a legend of sport. At 36, he proved once again that age is just a number and quickly satisfied the expectations of the thousands of fans who, 19 years earlier, saw an impish and irreverent young man step on the old Trafford lawn, which the years have turned into a universal reference. With an unmeasured ambition and an incomparable winning spirit, Cristiano Ronaldo continues to prove, to himself and to others, that, at 37 years old, it is by his own merit that the world sees him as a legend of sport.